Welcome everyone. In this video I will preview the TS-54, which is an American premium heavy tank with a double gun. This is a very early preview, so I have only two images to share and analyze. With that said, let's get started. This tank has got five crew members with commander, gunner, driver and two loaders. Let's go now and uh, check the set of this tank. First of all, I want to mention that the gun of this tank is a 90mm cal caliber. Because, let's go now and take a look here, we have here the, the M3i uh, tank, which has actually the gun, as you, as you can see, is the same 90mm caliber look, the end of the barrel and the muzzle brake here. So, this is a 90mm caliber gun, and I want to go back to this uh, double gun, Object 703 version 2, because I'm going to compare this tank against this uh, American tank. So. As you can see, 90 meter caliber gun we got here, and let's go now and check the stats. So, this tank got 280 alpha damage with uh, 8.15 sec reload, which means our base DPM is 2061. This is an auto reloader tank like the Russian 703 tank, and uh, the aim time of this tank is 3.36, and uh, the dispersion values are 0.42. These values are same like the Russian tank has here this uh, Object 703 with 122 mm caliber gun. This is a very, very good tank. As you can see, dispersion values 0.42 and uh, in time 3.36. So the gun stats and values are matching. We have here 8 degree of gun depression and uh, 20 degree of elevation. 8 degree of gun depression is actually amazing. So the base penetration value of the AP shell is 200 mm, with, which is really low and bad. So we have here to reload the whole, you have two shells in the magazine. To reload, to reload the full magazine will take you 16.3 sec. To, the intra crib reload time is, the, is 3 sec and you have two shells in the magazine. So which, which means you are fully loaded, you shoot once and you, you have to wait 3 seconds to shoot the next shot. This That means. So the salvo fire, uh, uh, the double shot actually. You have to hold down your specific key, for example, the V key for 2.5 sec to launch the double shot and after you shoot the double shot, you are penalized for six sec. So you have to wait six seconds. After that, your reload time will start and you will uh, actually start to reload the first shell in the magazine. So you have a six second penalization after you do a double shot the solo fire so the hp of this tank is 1400 the armor uh, this is the whole armor uh, he, here it says it has 102 millimeters front rear and side so yeah the turret armor from uh, front actually got around 305 millimeter but i bet this is only for the gunman that this is only 305 millimeter the rest as you can see already weaker here these cheeks and uh, the top i assume this is penetrable with heat ammunition and here maybe some weak spots so and this uh, huge turret ring actually can be weak so I assume this is just only 305 millimeter. The turret side is 127 and the rear side of the turret is uh, 76. So yeah, this tank weighs in 50 tons with 570 horsepower. The speed, forward speed is 35 km per hour and the backward speed is 15. I would say 570 horsepower for a 50 ton tank is actually weak and this tank might have, might will be struggled to reach this uh, 35 km per hour in all uh, type of terrain, which means in soft terrain it will go like 32 and 30 and on. So yeah, this uh, horsepower just not enough for a 50 ton tank. But yeah, the view range of this tank is 380 meters. So actually good view range for here. Let's go now and check the ammunition type of this tank. So here, we have a uh, base ammunition AP shell, as you can see, with uh, 280 alpha damage. The penetration value is 200, bad penetration value, obviously, and the shell velocity speed is 878. It's good, it's average speed, not slow, but not fast. So, yeah. And this tank can take up 40 ammunitions, as you can see. The AP shell ammunition uh, got a, pen a penetration of 252 millimeters of AP shell penetration. It's not, yeah, it's average. It's not that uh, good. 252 
could be higher let's say it's a heavy tank after all but uh, this 90 meter caliber gun is it, it's a it's a small caliber not like 122 it's only 90 so yeah understandable the shell velocity speed 1098 this is a lackluster value this apcr shell could be faster like 1150 or 1250 so it's not the fastest apcr shell and it cost uh, 4400 uh, credit to shoot uh, 280 alpha damage ammo so yeah if you're gonna spell you, you, you're gonna spam full APCR ammunition this is not uh, a good deal not a good idea to do because you will this will cost a lot yeah the HE shell the HE shell is just useless and bad as you can see only 47 millimeters of penetration for an HE shell this is just uh, bad the it but it can do 370 alpha damage so yeah but the shell the shell speed is the same as the AP shell average uh, stat value here but this penetration is just bad so yeah let's go back uh, to our tank as you can see so the conclusion about this tank is uh, it's a uh, idea of depression obviously really good the 280 alpha damage is I would say it's a small it's it's for a heavy tank it's bad to have only 280 alpha damage but uh, the double gun uh, mechanism is actually really good, AD gun depression good. We have to see uh, the how good the armor is on this uh, turret, and these are only early early stats preview. So if I will have more information, I will show you and I will do another video. So yes, thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe.